All right, well, right now I can tell you that the Billabong Pro Pipeline is a competition that's taking place in Hawaii, and it runs until the 10th of February, one of the biggest and best uh, surfing competitions in the world that calls on the very best from around the world to participate. And right there, Africa is being represented by our very own Matthew McGivory, as well as Morocco's Ramsey Bukiam. Now, here's what both of these guys had to say about their participation in the competition. I think there's always going to be nerves coming, in, coming into your first event. There's been a long off season now for everyone. It's the longest break I've had myself. But it's been so good to have that chance to reset and kind of come in fresh now, come in extra motivated. And it's straight into Pipeline, one of the gnarliest waves on tour, the ultimate proving ground. So I'm super excited just to be back with everyone and uh, back on tour. I guess with the Olympics being every four years, there can be added pressure to be surfing in the Olympics when it's your, your peak performance, which is probably when you're around 28 years old, I'd imagine 27, 28. At the moment, I'm 25 turning 26, so I'm coming into that prime for myself. So I'm definitely hoping to capitalize in the next couple of years, and hopefully in this Olympics and the next one as well. I feel like I've got two chances here to make it count. 10 years, 10 years on the QS, you know, fighting, fighting, fighting to, to, to get the opportunity to surf against the best in the world and uh, in the best waves in the world. You know, it took me a lot of time to be like this, huh? and I'm still working on it. Huh? Uh, but for sure, in those 10 years, I had a lot of moments, you know, injuries and stuff, and a lot of moments where I doubt myself. I doubt everything, not only myself, the whole thing. Maybe it wasn't meant to be and stuff. Of course, those, those, those thoughts come into, into your head and uh, but you can't let them, you know, you can't let, you can't let them get to you, you know, and uh, to be the first Moroccan to qualify for the Olympics, for the CT, it's just, you know, and, and I have a lot of support, man, you know. All Morocco is, surfing is getting really big in Morocco and uh, everyone's behind me and I feel that support. A oh, big shout out to the brothers flying the African flag very, very high and good luck for the future of your surfing careers as well. Keep shredding it on those waves.